Hello everybody, thank you so much for watching. My name is Alexander, I'm a Porsche certified sales professional at Porsche West Palm Beach and thanks so much for watching my YouTube workaround videos. If you appreciate my videos, please consider subscribing to my channel, please hit that like button and feel free to comment down below. You can also contact me directly via cell phone or email with my contact information being the video description. In today's workaround video, I want to present you this spectacular brand new 2024 Porsche 718 Spider RS. This Spider RS just arrived at our dealership. At the time of recording this specific YouTube video, this car is actually available from New Car Inventory, which, based on the current marketplace conditions, is a very special opportunity as there's very few new Spider RSs available in the US marketplace. There are some terms and conditions regarding the availability, so please contact me directly to confirm the availability, the pricing, and of course the full specifications. In today's walk-on video, we're going to highlight the build specifications on this specific car, talk about the details on both the outside and the inside, and of course also talk about the Spider RS in general. This is the ultimate open-top mid-engine 718. Powered by a GT3 4.0-liter flat-six derived engine, producing almost 500 horsepower with a 9,000 RPM redline, connected to a 7-speed PDK dual-clutch transmission. Of course, many things are also similar to the 718 Cayman GT4 RS, as the Cayman and the box, of course, share many components. But again, this is the open-top version, specifically the Spider RS. Based off the 718, so the most extreme interpretation of 718, many carbon fiber body panels, on the, both the hood as also the fenders made out of carbon fiber. Now this specific one is a Visac package option car. Now the Visac package has normally a fully exposed carbon hood. This specific one optioned with the center stripe uh, that is painted by Porsche on the carbon fiber. We saw it years ago also on the GT2 RS models of the 991.2 generation. Beautiful craftsmanship to see that blend between the carbon exposed and the paint in the middle section. The actual color of this vehicle is vanadium gray metallic, a new color within the Porsche brand, also now available in the 992 Generation 2 as in a factory color, but vanadium gray introduced on the 718 Spider RS. This specific vehicle has a factory option, also equipped with the LED headlights as a factory upgrade. So normally the Spider RS has the Xenon units, again this one upgraded to the full LED units. Looking in the front, a very similar design to the 718 Cayman GT4 RS. Now, one big difference between the two is going to be the size here of the front splitter. As with the Spider RS, downforce is not of a main priority. Porsche has of course aerodynamically redesigned the 718 Spider RS versus the Cayman uh, GT4 RS in terms of different uh, downforce levels and therefore aerodynamically a different front splitter on the front end. We can also see the NECA ducts similar to the GT4 RS. So these intakes will actually uh, guide the air to the front brake calipers in terms of cooling down the front brakes. Racing technology introduced many years ago on the 991.2 uh, GT3 RS and GT2 RS. Again, the engine a flat six, 9,000 RPM redline, 4 liter, naturally aspirated engine. Now, this one next to the Weissack package is also optioned with the magnesium wheels. So, the standard lightweight aluminum wheels were replaced with the magnesium wheels. Those magnesium wheels are 20 inches in the front and rear. In this case, fitted with the Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires. So very sticky rubber on both the front and the rear. N1 rated tire, so of course Porsche approved. And right behind you can see this one also optioned with the PCCB, the Porsche Common Composite Brake System. A very similar design is the design of the fenders. Look how beautiful these cutouts here in terms of aerodynamics. Also, of course, these openings on the top, just like the GT4 RS, to remove the turbulent air that builds up in the front wheel wells at high speed driving. And with these exits here, which were introduced, by the way, on the 991.2 GT3 RS, oh, sorry, on the 991.1 GT3 RS, uh, there's less turbulent air or positive pressure being built up in the front wheel wells. And therefore, this creates a positive effect on the overall stability and downforce level of the Spider RS. Again, here to the side, we can also see the carbon fiber mirror caps. Also the intakes here to feed the air to the 4 liter flat six finished in carbon fiber. As a factory option, this one also has the window triangle. So this little piece here behind the mirror as a carbon fiber element, beautiful. And the actual intakes to the engine itself is going to be here on the top. Of course, the GT4 RS being a closed cabin has a very specific intake design, but also for the Spider RS, Porsche completely redesigned the intake system to get the right volume of air to the 4 liter flat six. These beautiful carbon fiber finished intakes. You can also see the uh, convertible top uh, opening loops there on the back and finished in red as standard. 
look how beautiful that is. You can imagine the volume of air that goes into the intake, and especially with the roof removed, with a passenger or driver, of course, sitting here, that incredible intake sound, especially the high RPM. Got the opportunity to drive one a few weeks ago, and from 7,000 to 9,000 RPM is an incredible intake sound right next to the driver and the passenger. Again, the magnesium wheels, of course, as I mentioned earlier. Getting here to the back, we see the double bubble effect a convertible top here or rooftop design of course similar to the 718 spider which is no longer in production we only have now the spider rs introduced by the way as a model year 24 and a porsche is also going to make a few 2025s beautiful double bubble inspired of course by the classic spiders from back in the day also similar by the way to the speedster models of the porsche 911. also the roll hoops finished in carbon fiber so many carbon fiber elements on this 718 Spider RS, both the intakes as the roll hoops, here are the uh, side intakes for the radiators, the front fenders, the front hood. So incredible material use for the 718 Spider RS. Rear wheel drive, of course. Look at this beautiful large spoiler design. And also again, from an aerodynamic standpoint, of course, reconfigured versus a Cayman GT4 RS. Also this little uh, carbon fiber gurney flap here on the edge of the rear spoiler and of course the spider rs badging on the back exhaust system the same as the cayman gt4 rs these very large exhaust systems inspired by the classic 935 with this titanium exhaust tip design also with the outer ring looking spectacular and this very large diffuser shape in the middle section of the lower rear fascia tail lights similar to the gts 4 liter cayman or boxster and also the spider with this dark inside housing no red as you can see in inside the tail lights on the back okay let's have a look on the inside this one equipped with the leather interior package with 18-way adjustable sports seats plus a combination of black leather with race tax inserts this one has the stitching finished in arctic gray which is a grayish bluish stitching therefore you can also see visac rs in arctic gray and then the layout of the actual test track of in Weissach, Germany is going to be always finished in the, um, in the slate gray color. Also in the door panel, you can see again, the combination of black leather, race tags, and the Arctic gray stitching. Being an RS product, we see the door opening loops to open the door panel. And then this one is also equipped with the optional Bose speakers. Another factory option is more karma fiber in the form of the LED illuminated side sill. As I mentioned, this is the optional 18-way Sports Seats Plus. And then to give some extra color to the inside, this one also the yellow seat belts, which of course matches very nicely with the yellow painted calipers based on the PCCB brakes. Brand new vehicle, only available with PDK transmission as RSs have been now for many years. Being a Weissack, you also get the plaque there on the passenger side, indicating the Weissack package. So it's on the headrest, it's on the plaque. And of course, also this beautiful GT Sport steering wheel with the yellow 12 o'clock marker. Inside, very similar, for example, to a 718 Spider, but then the dashboard finished in race text on the top is specific to the Cayman GT4 RS and to the Spider RS of the 718. I want to thank you for watching this video. Again, my name is Alexander, Porsche certified sales professional at Porsche West Palm Beach. I've been with Porsche since 2016. If you like my YouTube videos, please consider subscribing, hit that like button. And again, at the time of recording this video, this specific 718 Spider RS is available from New Car Inventory. There are terms and conditions, so please contact me directly to confirm the availability and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much once again for watching and see you next time. Bye-bye.